Hello, I'm Dr. Rob Lawson. I'm a history professor here at Dean College, also director of the Honors Program. I've been here about 11 years, and in that time, have fallen in love with Dean History. As we're celebrating our 150th year, uh, we're going to take you through that history as well, with a series of short films all around this beautiful campus. So let's go for a journey in the past. Welcome to the Emmons Farm. Well, it's not the Emmons Farm anymore. Uh, of course, this is the home of Dean College, originally Dean Academy, that was founded on the farmland of Reverend Nathaniel Emmons, who was an important Congregationalist preacher here in town. Oliver Dean joined a separate sect of Christianity here in Franklin, which was the Universalists. And in fact, the first building that was um, constructed on this landscape was in fact the Universalist Church, which um, today is the Green Family Library Learning Commons. That church was constructed in the 1850s and it was home of the Franklin Universalist congregation until the 1960s. So Dean purchased this land from Emmons and began his mission of universalism. Uh, the next step was the founding of the academy. Originally, Dean had hoped to found an actual college for the Universalist Church, but he was beat out in that effort by Charles Tufts and those who founded Tufts College, which of course today is Tufts University. So when the call came forth for an academy that would feed into uh, Tufts College, Dean answered that call and created Dean Academy. The first building, and still the most magnificent of course, is Dean Hall. This isn't what it looked like when it was first constructed in 1866, 1867. We'll tell you more about how the building came to look like it does today. So from farmland to churchyard to academy, this landscape has gone through quite a transformation in the last 150 some years.